Wherever you are around the world, we thank you for joining us here at Optus Stadium. The Pat Cummins won the toss and he elected to bat first on a, on a pitch that looks like it'll have plenty of life. First short ball, beautifully put away by David Warner. No need to run at all. There's so much room out there, but that was uh, very compact. Oh, oh dragged it on. The first opening blow for the West Indies. Allows him to bowl a fraction straighter, but uh, no real shape on that delivery and the short straight boundary. Oh, just through the gap. It's a small gap. But that's going to win the race too, that ball. So Marnus opens his account. Just flows into the shot there, Larvishane. Picked it up early, hit it forward to square. Oh, that's awkward. Really awkward. Actually fixed him up first ball with a really yeah, nice man. bouncer. Beats the fielder mid off the boundary. I think Chase is too happy with that. I thought probably the fielder could do a little bit more, but the Australians will be happy. Down the wicket and goes for it. Really well played from Kawaja. Over the fence it goes. It. It's pulled away nicely. Should get to the rope, and it does. So it's Kowarcha going along nicely. Kimar Roach. Ooh. Did just move it off the pitch there, caught Marnus by surprise. Oh, that's a peach. Almost unplayable, really. Well, that caught everyone by surprise. I imagine he's gone for the Yorker, but he's just uh, off his target. The leading edge. That's beautifully timed. Just a punch. Nothing too extravagant from Labashane, but he'll reap four runs. Catch it was the call. But it was beautifully worked to the leg side. Just pivoted on that back foot, did Kawaja. Oh, there's a leg gully for that very stroke, that very delivery. But uh, Marnus gets it through to the boundary, moves to 47. Yes, well, finds the gap on this occasion, Marnus Labashain. And that'll take him to his 14th test match half century. Yeah. Really well placed. Beautifully timed, another boundary for Marnus Labashain. Workman like here today. Ooh, looked a little bit awkward. Very much so. Frustration there for the West Indies, but a boundary for Marnus. Edged away, and it's a boundary again. Oh, rubbing salt into the wound there. It's very good bowl on this from Seals. Squeezed away, and that'll race away. No more of this off the stadium grass. Yes. And that'll be his 50. We've had it. He's from Kawaja. Been in the slipstream a little bit, I suppose, to Marnus Labashane, but very, very effective. That's his chance. Yes. Bouncing through midwick at the end. Just sat up long enough for Kawaja, who's looking better by the minute. 150 up for Australia. Kyle Mayer's back into the attack, which has been a while. No! Little touch, and he's done it. He's done it straight away. It seemed the most likely this morning, and we've waited forever this afternoon. He's got one. The edge, and oh, no. It went to the tallest player with the biggest reach. He couldn't get it. Four slips in position. Immediately on the front foot, Stephen Smith whacks it away over backward square to set a statement early. Throws everything out at Marnus. That's one of the shots of the day. Driven purposefully through the covers. Smith through the gap. Fielders give up. Well, that's a beautiful shot, and that's probably the first sign of his new sort of technique. 
beautifully driven. Perfectly driven by Manus Labashay, and he moved to 94. And a beautiful extra cover drive, even though they have that extra cover there. Oh, it's challenging. That'll frustrate Jaden Seals no end, so too the West Indian ca captain. It is an opening day test match century to save it for Manus Labashain. It uh, gets across the outfield into the boundary. It is his eighth test match century. High quality stuff. He invested early and he reaps the rewards late in the day. Mr. Reliable does it again. Well, there's quite a few things that mark an Australian summer with the beginning of, and it appears a Manus Labashain century is now one of them. Now we know summer's around. Shot. Oh, that's perfection from Stephen Smith. First delivery of a new spell. Shot. Exactly where you mentioned Kerry O'Keefe. Steve Smith invited to walk through again, and he does so. It's another boundary, so two in the over. It's a time that also the batsman wants to cash in. That five, six overs before, you know, the new ball comes in. Takes it up and over the top. That's all the way from Arnis. Beautifully played. <laughs> that is a great shot from Labuschagne. He made no attempt of getting on top of it. He deliberately lifted the ball up high. He was only hit, trying to hit it for six there. He was trying to hit it fine, but just helped it on its way. A pat on it. Runs for Australia. Oh my goodness. That's Pretty well bowled, but well played. Didn't turn. Did him in the flight. He was good enough, Manus. Oh. And there it is. 50 for Steve Smith. Cruising down the other end. 17th time he's done that. Oh, no. Up and under. Smith throws everything at that, manages to keep it down and rockets away over the carpet-like surface. Thing, and that's red. He might have had his eye on 150 when he came to the ground, and now that's come to fruition as well. Really? <laughs> oh, oh my goodness me. That's something to dine out on overnight, Manus. Yeah, wonderful days, cricket. Uh, Marcus, 154.